Hey guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Karen. So today we're going to be doing the second cash envelope stuffing of April 2024. So you can see I have my cash and I have my coins. The coins go into a challenge called the bagged bank where I put it in the bag, mark it off my tracker and then eventually when it reaches the amount that it can go to the bank and they'll just take it, lodge it in. Um, so that's why it's called bag to bank. So I have my cash here on top of my um, cash holder. So we have 50, 100, 150, 200, 250, 270, 80, 90, 300, and 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95. That was 395 euros altogether, which is exactly what I want. So we'll, you're going blurry guys, you're going blurry. And then I have some coins here as well. Let me try on blur you. Okay, that took two seconds to do that. Okay, so we have our wallet divider. So this is my wallet that I bring out and about with me. Um, so inside grocery we have 10 euros left over so we're gonna put that up here and um, we're gonna put in a hundred euros inside grocery then we have diesel diesel has nothing because we used it but we're gonna put 25 inside diesel medical we had to use 10 euros of it today because Ava's after getting a flare of her eczema or eczema so we had to use some of it, so I'm going to put a 10 in again today. So we have 50, 60, 70, 85 in medical. And house is going to get 10 euros. So we have 25 in house. So they're always the quick and easy ones. They don't involve much thought. We put them back in here so that when I go to the shop, I know what's in what. Then we go to this binder here, which has our annual stuff, maybe. Can't really remember. Okay, this first one is glasses. Then we have, uh, glasses is full. So then we have Mosher tax, and that's gonna get 10, or five euros. So we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100 euros in there. So we need to pay Robert's motorbike tax, which is 88 euros. And then we have to save for the car's NCT, which is like a yearly test that it has to pass. So I think that's 50 or 55 euros. We have the car insurance and that's going to get five as well. So we have 200, 300, 350, 55, 60, 65. So 365 euros in there. Um, we can't mark anything off there because they go up in 50s. So once we get to 400, that's when the next mark of the car insurance. And then we can move on to motorbike insurance after that. We have some motor maintenance, which is repair. If we need any repairs or parts or anything for the car and the motorbike. So we have 500 in the bank. So 510, 20, 30. So 530 euros in there, which is great. Then we have clothes. So we're going to add five euros to clothing. So we have 50, 70, 90, 95, 100, 105 euros again in there. <coughs> so I still have a cough, but barely have it, you know, like it only comes sometimes now. Um, wedding and camping, they're all fun and rainy day fund is fine as well. So how have you all been this week? Um, for us it was kind of quiet. We didn't really do anything too exciting at the weekend, just gone. And um, we took it kind of easy and the same probably this time as well because I think Robert is doing a job on Saturday. Um, so for sure Saturday will be quite one and then hopefully the weather is good as in not raining on Sunday and we can get out and about and go somewhere because being stuck in is just too much so this is Ava's binder so everything in here is for Ava or related to Ava so first off is school so school is gonna get five euros so we have a hundred and fifty seventy seventy five eighty one hundred and eighty euros so we'll pop that in 
<clears throat> these are all turkeys so we have one extra because we did have to use this oh yeah because I bought her a pair of shoes um, over the Easter break so we have one extra colored in which is fine and this is the tracker for the dance but I don't <laughs> I don't actually use it so we're gonna add 10 euros to dance so we 50 70 90 100 110 so it's 60 euros a term we have two so dance is starting back today and we have two classes left from the last term and then I think we ha might have two terms after this. So this should be, once I get to 120, that should be enough. Swimming's not getting anything. Ava's not getting anything. And then this is money left over from her birthday. And she has spent some of it on various different things. So we have this, which is um, like annual events that happen, I suppose. Um, so first off is birthdays. Birthdays is going to get 10 euros. So we have 50, 60, 70, 80 euros in there now. So next birthday is um, two weeks. Um, and then the one after that is my birthday. So we have Father's Day. I didn't, oh I did put money in Father's Day. We're putting 10 euros in Father's Day. So we will add 10 there. So the goal is 120. So right now we have 20, 40, 55. So 55. So we can mark off this one. So we'll do yellow. And then next time we'll be able to do the next one. So, um, actually, was that too much? Yeah, no, it wasn't. It was okay. Um, and then summer, we're going to just add five euros this week. Um, so we have a hundred, or 50, 60, 65, 70. 70 euros now. And again, these are going up in 50. So when we get to 100, that's when we can mark that off. Nothing else in this binder needs to be done. So we'll leave that there. We go to our challenge binder. So let's see, let's see, let's see. First one I want to flip to in here is the Saver Friday. Um, so in here we are, at, these are all of the dates of the Fridays of the month. So you can see this Friday it's going to be the 12th. So I have a 10 here and then I'm taking out a 2 from there so that's the 12 so we're going to put that in so 10 and then the 2 so we'll get our black sharpie and we'll mark that off that we've put it in so um, then this one is just gonna get 10 euros now you can see I did condense it down so this was like this first box was nearly full but I condensed it down and just got all the bigger ones um, just because some weeks I can only put like like this week like I could only put 10 euros and then I just couldn't find like a 10 euro um, so we'll add the 10 in there so we have 500 600 650 670 680 90 705 so 705 euros in there now which is great this is going to be for Christmas so we're gonna mark off the 10 euros I can see here So mark that off. So this is the bag to bank I was talking about. So these are, done, are nearly done. So there's four of these needing to be done. Okay, so we don't have that because I actually spent that two euros to buy bread yesterday. So let's do the coins here and I'm gonna try and do them quickly. I say that every week. We have two euros, one euro, a 50 cent, 
five senses, 10 senses, and two cents. So we have no 20s and no ones. So let's start from the big one. So we have three, one, three, two euros. So next week we will for sure be finished that. One, two, and three. So in there it goes. Right then with the one euro we have one of them. So we'll add that in. And then we'll flip and mark it off. Woo! Goodness. 50 cents we have one of them as well. So 50s, again, we'll add that in, flip it over, mark it off. 10 cents, we have three of them. The 10 cents somehow end up so dirty. Anyways, three of them. So we need to get, flip it to the 10 cents one. So we have one, two, and three. Five senses, we have three of them. So in they go. Again, we flip it. One, two, and three. And the two cents, we also have three. One, two, three. And we flip that to the twos. One, two, and three. So lots of these are going to come to the end soon because um, you can see that we've already done one pass of it. Some of them require two pa two times completing this. And you can see we've completed on the one cent. We have that. So we have 14 left. We have 15 twos left because we've completed one. Um, and the five senses were only on our first go around because you can see it's not marked. Um, the ten senses, we have 17 of them left to go. Uh, we have 21 20 senses. We have 16 50 senses. We still have a good amount of one euros. And then we just need that one two euro for that to be done. So... The only other thing in here that's getting money is this 52 envelope and we're putting in 15 euros. So I'm going to mark off 15 here. Again, I condensed this down earlier, or yesterday actually. So condense that in. And then we're gonna just roll this up. Well, kind of like loosely roll it and then off to the side here, I'm putting it in my tin. I just don't want to move it because there's lots of stuff behind it. Um, <clears throat> but slowly but surely we're getting that done. So hopefully we can kind of concentrate on it a little tiny bit more. So we're onto the 5k now and we have 150 set aside this week. And then we have 10 euros left over from our groceries. So we're going to put that whole 160 into this 1000 envelope here. So 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40. Ooh. So 140 is what's due to go in here, which is great. So what I'm gonna do is take out this 10 euros and then this should now be a thousand euros in here. So 500, 700, 750, 8, 850, 9, 950, a thousand. Yes! So that one is now complete, which is so nice that the three big ones are now done. That's 140. And then this 20 euros is going to go into the next one, which is 15s. But also this money here at the front, which is 15. So we're going to leave five of it in there actually because this goes up in 15 so we're going to leave five of that in there and we're going to put 30 euros 
inside this 750 envelope to start it off so 30 euros has gone in there which means we can mark two of these which is great so that's 1500 envelope complete the 1000 envelope complete and now this 1000 envelope complete we've started the 750 um, and we're going to mark off the tracker here at the front to say yes we have completed that 1000 so yeah I'm absolutely delighted with that that, um, that we have done that so now it's just 15 euros each time that we need um, as I said, this this top envelope here is just kind of like a holding envelope until we reach the amount that we can send it back to the envelope that we're working on. Um, so there's only three more envelopes left to go. So there, as I said, the 750 are in 15s, the 500 are in 10s, and then the 250, don't mind this, I just keep forgetting to mark that off. The 250s are in 5s, so that will be done in no time. I am absolutely delighted with that. So, there we have it guys. That is it. That is my cash stuffing for this week. As I said at the start, I hope you all are well. I hope everything is going as you want it to go this week. Um, I will talk to you in my next video. Bye guys.